A Toronto man is in the running to be one of the torchbearers at the Summer Olympics in Beijing. David Porches joins Aaron Roy, the woman we profiled last night, as one of a handful of people who may get to carry the torch. And as video journalist Debbie Lytle Kwan shows you, his path toward the Olympics began with a trip to Europe and a need to tell the stories of Canadian soldiers. He followed his childhood dream by following in the footsteps of others. And so with guitar and camera in hand, David Porches toured Europe, soaking up the history of World War II and in turn expressing it in film and music. By the end of my 38 days, uh, the count was around 35 songs that I wrote. So it was, it was a very productive uh, experience songwriting, but how could it not be? Me, I feel the bombs along the shore. I think it's important that we try to harness that history and remember it for future generations because once those veterans pass away, that's it. You know, it's up to us to carry their stories along. Porches returned to Toronto to finish recording and editing war music. But an online advertisement turned his attention from Europe to China in a contest to become an Olympic torchbearer for the 2008 Beijing Games. When, when I found this website and it said write a 50 word essay, I knew it was something I had to do. I followed the footsteps of soldiers who fought during World War II. Porches' essay countries. was chosen as one of 18 finalists from 6,000 applicants. He was then asked the to submit a 30 second video. The it's way. the seventh most popular in online voting. Only the top three will be chosen the... as torch bearers. I was crushing on my friend, nothing left short again. Happy but listening to David, you get the feeling he's fine with being a torch singer for Canada's World War II soldiers. Debbie Lytle Kwan, CBC News, Toronto. And we'll be tracking in the days ahead whether Aaron Roy or David Porches gets the chance to carry the torch in Beijing. The winners won't be formally announced till next month, but we'll bring the results then.